Hey everybody, I am 22 Tiger Dude and I am here to review the Spongebob episode Shell Shocked, requested by Alkison Super. And this episode is about when Spongebob accidentally breaks Gary's shell. So Spongebob has to take Gary to Angry Jack Shell Emporium to help him find his new shell. Okay, and so my thoughts on this episode... This episode has some hate, some liked it, some not quite so much, and some just plain old flat out <laughs> hated the episode. And that's understandable in my opinion, but I thought this episode was really enjoyable. I really liked Shell Shocked. I thought it was a well done episode. I thought it was a very funny episode for the most part. And I thought it was constructed well for the most part. What I really liked about this episode was just... A simple plot of trying to find Gary a new shell. And it was a little disturbing when Gary's ba uh, back was like all p p p puffing when his shell broke. That's not my problem though. That That's one, that's one thing I could let slide too. Yes, the scene where SpongeBob is giving his organs to Angry Jack near the end. I could let that slide too. Uh... The problem I had with Shell Shocked was, unfortunately, Mr. Krabs not willing to help Spongebob for free. There was a little catch in order for Mr. Krabs to help uh, Gary find a new shell. Because Mr. Krabs makes an appearance in the last two minutes of the episode. But I mean, it would have been nice to see Mr. Krabs, for once, help Spongebob with no catch no cost or any of that stuff like seriously he he's done so much for mr krabs and mr krabs can at least done it for free even though this was a huge favor and he was making a little sacrifice for the ending which i'm not going to spoil and i thought spongebob breaking shells at angry jack shell emporium it got old uh, after a while like the first time he broke it okay it was funny Second time, and then another few times, it's like, okay, this is just getting repetitive. Where, where are you getting your episode? It was really funny when he tipped over those drawers, and then you saw the Domino's reference, and he broke the whole Emporium. That one actually cracked me up. Also, the funniest part in the whole episode, though, and... This is actually a very quotable one because I actually repeat this quote a lot. It was Angry Jack's commercial. The commercial. When he's all like, he's really mad. Don't bring your kids. Blistering Fury. Like, I can't stop saying those quotes that were in Angry Jack's commercial. That was the highlight of the episode, in my opinion. And... There are some misses in terms of the comedy, too, and the episode felt a little off in a couple of scenes, in my opinion. But overall, I really think Shell Shocked is a well-done episode, and I, I just dug the plot. I just dug everything. I can understand some people not enjoying the episode, but me, personally, I really enjoyed the hell out of it. So I'm going to give Shell Shocked... A 9 out of 10. Subscribe. Follow me on Facebook, Twitter. Comment to give me your thoughts on the Spongebob episode. Like and share this video. I will always have... TAGA POWER!